Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Glitchcraft. Yes, it's been a little while since I looked at the Glitchcraft Glitch server, and it looked really different. And there's a reason for that. This is now the Glitchcraft mod pack. And let's see if I can pull that up. Can I pull up mods while I'm actually in-game, or do I have to disconnect? Uh, boop. There we go. Yes, a absolute ridiculous number of mods that Zog was kind enough to put together for us. And he did this a while ago, but, uh, you know, I haven't been playing too much. Uh, Cosmo said he was going to be on, but he hasn't. Zog said he was going to be on, but he hasn't. And uh, I haven't seen Flame in like a week. I mean, I know he's been on online, but I haven't seen him in like a week. But uh, nobody's been on the server. I know that for a fact because I left the server turned off for a week and nobody said a thing. So, yeah. Um, but, you know, I really like Minecraft and I've been watching, you know, buildy stuff from other YouTubers. And I'm like, you know what? I want to build. I really do, and I should really put forth some effort into... I got a pine cone. This thing seems a lot more glitchy today than it was. What's a pine cone for? I can't plant it. Uh, you. I can make pine nuts. Uh, organic matter compressor. Enchantments? I have no idea. Um, so what the hell was I saying? Oh, yes. Uh, this is a very, very weird mod pack. And the reason for that... Well, aside from the fact that it has uh, 79 pages of items here. If we look at the pickaxes, uh, regular iron pickaxe, this tool cannot mine anything. It can only be used for crafting. Wooden pickaxe. This tool cannot be mine anything. It can only be used for crafting. Stone pickaxe. This tool cannot mine anything. It can... You get the point. Vanilla pickaxes don't do shit anymore. There's a mod in here, and I don't remember what it's called. It's a lizard something, or something like that, that makes you, forces you to use Thomcraft to do anything. Or, no, not Thomcraft. Uh, Tinker's Construct. We have Thomcraft. And I better hurry the hell up. Um, and I don't know if Thomcraft is actually going to be a problem for us later on. I'm not sure because, you know, right there, as you can see, right there, we have the taint. And if I remember correctly, the taint is one bad and two spreads. And I don't like this. But we also have those, like, tiny black hole things. You can see I have a death point over there, multiple death points. I don't know why I have two. I only died once. I'm going to sleep because I don't like dealing with night. Um, but, yeah, so I've already died at the death point. All of my stuff is there. So I have to start from scratch, almost from scratch anyway. So I'm going to do exactly that. I'm basically just going to start again. Um... And I'm going to just record it this time and start actually trying to enjoy this mod pack, even though I do have my issues with it. Uh, let's see, what do I got? Uh, okay, so obviously one of the first things we need is a pickaxe, because we can't do shit. We can't even make a furnace without a pickaxe, because we can't mine stone without a pickaxe. Because if I go in... Uh, do I still have it? I apparently do not. Yes, I do. Wooden pickaxe. So, wooden pickaxe, stone, says currently harvestable. Does nothing. Absolutely nothing. I can punch the block, and it, you can see up at the top in the Weala thing, it says progress and stuff like that. Obviously, if I punch a stone block, it'll just pop and it won't give me anything. So, it's kind of worthless to me. What do I have? I got a tool rod, tough rod. Hmm. All right, so I need stuff. And it was suggested that I use a flint 
pickaxe to start with, but this is Tinker's Construct, so pretty much anything you can make, you can use. So if we look at the, you know, what's all in there, hold shift, we can use stone, flint, obsidian, nether rack, thomium, uh, all kinds of stuff, but uh, I have flint on me. Now, also fun fact, you can't get flint from uh, mining gravel. What you got to do is you got to take three gravel to turn it into a flint. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Uh, let's think. Uh, boop. Yes, part builder. Uh, I need the pickaxe head. So flint pickaxe head. Ooh, actually, you know what? Let's do some comparisons here. Let's... I have stone around here somewhere, don't I? Did I actually get any stone, or... I didn't get that far in playing the first time round, as you can see. Uh, this stuff can all be made by wood. All the initial Thomcraft stuff can be made just with wood and with a crafting table, or... Yeah, I think just with a crafting table. Uh, so it's fairly straightforward anyways. So you are... Stone pickaxe head can only be used to make casts, cannot be used to make a tool. Alrighty then, flint it is. Doesn't really do much, but flint it is. Alright, so what can I use to make the bind? Uh, stone, cactus, obsidian. I know these things do special things. Uh, okay, so stone is pretty much out entirely. So let's get me some wood. I have wood, but I don't have any wood planks. All right, so what it is. Bloop. All right, yes. I know uh, if you use special stuff, like paper gives you an extra slot for upgrades later, but I don't think we're there yet. Bloop. And then I have a bone tool rod right there, so... Let us make our pickaxe. Now, I did a little bit of research. Yeah, flint pickaxe. Repair material flint, durability 130, mining speed 4. Nah. That was a weird sound. <laughs> I had never heard that sound before. All right, let's see. Wood, wood, wood. Plant, plant. And then all of this stuff can go in here for now. All right, so now I have a flint pickaxe. Do I have anything interesting sword-wise? I probably need a regular tool. Oh, these are all stone. These things don't do shit. No wonder I could never, you know, find anything or make anything. Hmm, let's see. Can I make a flint sword? So that's a sword pattern. Stone, thomium, certus quartz, ender, amethyst. No. All right, so I need special shit for a sword anyways. However, fun fact. I can make a stone sword just fine. So it's just the tools, the, the shovels, the axes, the pickaxes. You know, those you have to use uh, Tinker's Construct for, but the swords, eh, it's just like normal. So what's the first thing we really have to do? I think I need a shovel for these guys. Yeah, shovel for them. Boop. Let's go look at one of the problems that I have with this mod pack. It's a minor problem, shouldn't be a big problem, but it is a problem that I have and that is right up here Bloop. right there all right so you can see my other pickaxe I'm also not pressing any buttons and I'm being pulled forward by this damn thing um and you just heard it do it did I just hear it again hmm but basically it's it's one of them black hole things from Thomcraft that eats the uh, environment. Yeah, it just ate a block there. It ate another block there. This is glitchy as hell. Why is this flashing like that? 
It's never done that before. Well, in the very rare times that I've actually played this mod pack. Hmm. I need food. Come back here. Thank you. Yeah, that's one of the first things I need to do is get food. Because all of the food that I did have is in the black hole. Kind of pissed. But I totally didn't even see it. Those things are almost impossible to see. So you have to be looking for the crater that they make. So if you're unlucky enough and one's in the sky, <laughs> you don't see the crater it makes. And it kind of sucks. Uh, what important information we have here. I think we're on 1.7. Minecraft 1.7. As opposed to... Uh... Okay, these glitchies are getting annoying. What the hell? Uh, advanced OpenGL is off. Doesn't seem to do anything. I don't know what's causing all of this. I really have no idea. I don't know what the flashy chunks are for. But it's really, really annoying. Uh, yeah, 1.7. So we're on a more up-to-date mod pack, but we're not on the newest mod pack. Uh, as you can see, there's... Wait, mod pack? No, Minecraft version. That's the word I'm looking for. As you can see, there's a whole shit ton of mods involved, including Weala, uh, Botania, whatever the hell that is. But it adds all kinds of, you know, like plant life and stuff like that, which is cool. We have uh, Pooh over there. I'm not joking. It is quite literally a thing of poop. Yeah, no idea. Uh, I got bad news for you, chickens. You didn't drop anything. Why didn't you... Okay, so they do drop stuff. I, I worry about this mod pack because I don't know anything about it at all. And you can't just pick it up and play. I had to figure out why I couldn't um, make a pickaxe. Seriously, I, I spent two days trying to figure out why I couldn't make a pickaxe. I'm like, okay, well, it's got a problem with wooden pickaxes. What about stone pickaxes? So I tracked down a couple creepers, had them blow up stone for me until I got three of them and made a pickaxe. <laughs> made a pickaxe that way. And it totally didn't work because the vanilla pickaxes just don't work. And I mean, I don't understand why the diamond pickaxes are limited because one would think if you got far enough that you're making diamonds that it's not that hard. And I can't even mine coal. I need copper before I can mine coal and I've only got flint. Just kind of annoying. But that means I'm going to have to go mining a lot. Let's see, your copper. Get Harvest level, copper! Oh yeah, there was that problem that I can never figure out how to get past. Harvest level, copper. I can't mine copper ore until I have copper ore. I got nothing on that one. I don't know what the hell to do. I think that's kind of why I stopped playing this for like a week. I have absolutely no freaking clue what the hell to do. Does this stuff over here have the same problem? Like, can I get gravel easily? Let's see. Tin, gravel, effective tool, shovel, harvest level 10. So I need tin to get tin. I need copper to get copper. I am very lost. I really don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> I am very, very confused. Do I have charcoal anywhere? I do. Cook up some of this chicken that I just got. I mean, I know it's not... Well, if I cook up the pork, there's more of it, so I'm wasting less charcoal, and it uh, fills me up more. Hmm. But, yeah, that's this mod pack that I have absolutely no idea what the hell I'm doing. None at all. I have no idea how I'm supposed to get copper if I can't mine copper. 
unless I have copper, and I'm very, very confused. I wonder if there are other things that I could use. Like, I know I can't use vanilla ones, but are there other pickaxes that I can use that aren't? Hmm. Like, there's this guy. Ganny's Surface. Icy pickaxe. How do I make you? I need ice, which means I need silk touch. Let's see. That's Thomcraft. I can't do crap from Thomcraft. Uh, that's Thomcraft. Thomic Tinkerer. So it's a combination between Thomcraft and Tinker's Construct. Uh, Peridot pickaxe. This tool cannot mine anything. God damn it. How do I make glowstone pickaxe? Oh, I need glowstone ingots, which is just insane. Hmm. Basically, I'm trying to find anything that I can use to get around this limitation that I can't do anything. It's kind of when I went out looking before. I went and tried to track down uh, something, anything that I could use mystical light gray flower hmm. yeah i tried to track down pretty much anything i could use to do all of this so i basically went exploring i was looking for uh yo know, like one of the thomcraft th what are they called i don't know things i have no idea where the chests are and you might be lucky enough to get one of the thomcraft pickaxes or, 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 like, anything, for that matter. <laughs> Hopefully I can get some luck and make something, or find something that works. Ooh, yeah, there's that. Those big honking trees, like that guy right there, that's glitching the hell out. If you find one with uh, spider webs on it, you can find chests underneath that. So that's another thing I was doing. I was looking for stuff anything to help me get through this uh, problem but so far no luck in fact it was kind of bad luck because you know I died doing it and I lost my pickaxe well that's another thing we also have quicksand so that's another thing I have to worry about not fun not fun at all hmm. you know I respect um. yeah to get the iron gravel I need a harvest level of iron I wonder if that means anything you know useful probably not uh, do you have no you don't have spider webs but you're glitching to hell it's the thumbcraft stuff that's glitching out isn't it hmm maybe I could make an argument to get rid of thumb how did I turn around Yeah, let's go see what else we can find. Maybe we can find something somewhat useful. The fuck? Okay, so I can mine obsidian tiles with a flint pickaxe. But I can't get copper. So apparently the blood moon is rising and I feel I should be afraid very very afraid I mean there's nothing interesting so far which is zombies endermen lots of zombies I wonder if that's the trick it's just lots of these bastards very possible but uh ow whoa Okay, running the hell away. <laughs> okay, maybe I should have slept through the night like I was planning on. Um, ah. There's a, okay, there is a lot of these bastards. Mm. Can I do anything about that? Yes, yes I can. Mm -hmm. 
I wonder if this will work. <laughs> I have no idea if this will work. Let's find out. Boop, boop. You don't feel tired right now. So it makes me sleep or stay awake through the blood moon. God damn. The hell? I don't feel tired right now? Ah, oh, blizz. Yeehaw. Okie dokie. This is a very, very interesting mod pack. And I'm sure it could be fairly popular once we iron out a few kinks. Like, uh, oh, the uh, disappearing chunks. That's annoying as shit. Hmm. But, yeah, so in my exploring, I haven't really found anything. Uh, there's a mushroom biome over there, as you can see. It's kind of red now. But, yeah. Those are yellow. I'm fairly sure those are Blizz. The the, the freezer version of the Blaze. Um, yeah, so I found a mushroom biome. I found a very creepy sound that I couldn't trace. And that's about it. I haven't found shit. Uh, I found no structures. I haven't found a village. I haven't found those Thomcraft temple things. Um, I haven't found a jungle or a desert. I know there's a desert close to spawn, but I've already explored that desert. There's nothing there. Uh, yeah, so uh, I've got a lot of learning to do with this mod pack. And it's going to be quite difficult because... It's not a standard mod pack, so there's not going to be a wiki somewhere for it. I have to look up each individual mod, and I don't know what half the mods are, so I have no idea how they affect the other mods. <sighs> Let's just say it's not going to be easy, to say the least. Hmm. But I'm going to try to stick through it, and apparently I looked at an enderman at some point. What the fuck are those?! those camo creepers or is that just what creepers look like in the blood moon yeah so anyways um i'm gonna call this episode quits for today because i ain't getting anywhere so i will say to you guys as always Keep playing the game, and watch out for that blood moon. Holy shit. Nope, still can't sleep. Hmm. Multiple Tinker's Construct houses. The start of a forge. And some suicidal villagers. I think I'm going to live here now.